The family of 14-year-old Lackey High School football player Zayden Flemings wanted us to show you this picture. His mother says was taken after an alleged attack by another player here at Lackey Friday. Fleming's family believes the attack was directed by an older player and carried out by a teammate out of view of coaches in a wrestling room at the school after months of bullying and harassment. I met Zayden and the family today and was able to confirm in person his eye is still swollen shut and he's complaining about blurred vision and headaches. Here's grandmother Marlene Fleming's McCann holding back tears. His face is busted, his eyes closed, he has blood coming down his face. And I'm thinking, he, was, he, he just went over there and talked to the coach. Where was the coach? This is hazing. That's hazing from a team. Mother That's Shakitha hazing. Flemings called the Charles County Sheriff's Department and an ambulance Friday after the attack. She claims it happened after months of bullying, including Zayden having his pants pulled down in public and name calling about his weight. Friday, Fleming said her son, who is 14 and the youngest player on varsity, had been confronted by an older player earlier in the day, resulting in a fight. Fleming said Zayden left the building for lunch with her and then went back in the school with instructions from his mom to talk to coaches about the harassment. But she says he never made it. She says her son was ambushed by another player, taken into the school's wrestling room, and beaten by one player while others gathered around and took pictures. No coaches were present for the fight, according to Flemings. The family asked why coaches didn't call an ambulance or police, but instead released Zayden to his mom, who did. This is a football team. Do you believe that these young people are supervised appropriately? Definitely not. They're, they're unsupervised. They care about sports. They don't care about the kids. They don't care. He trusted that team. He trusted everyone on that team. And he trusted those coaches to protect him, and they did nothing for him at all. Nothing. Charles County Sheriff's Department confirms a 911 call was received and that an investigation spearheaded by Lackey School Resource Officer is underway. In a written statement, school authorities said they're investigating after two fights at the school Friday. They say they've never had a complaint about hazing. I've attempted to contact two of the football coaches and the school's principal and was referred by administrators to the school system's central office. Zayden Fleming's missed school today, he said, to recover from his injuries and because he says he does not feel safe here at Lackey High School in Charles County. Scott Broom, WUSA 9.